Hey guys, Brendan here, coming up by Ruby episode, Ruby Let's Play episode 2, sorry, I'm a little tongue twisted from eating out your mom. Uh, tell me what you think about that new intro. I thought it was pretty boss. Uh, I made it myself. I got the inspiration from Mike Wags. He wanted to do something like that for, um, for a Call of Duty edit. And he's gonna ask this guy named OCG, but, I mean, yeah, he's gonna ask this guy named OCG, but a bit off of it. Like a boss. Um, uh, this is my third time doing this commentary. The first time, um, I messed up completely. I stopped talking for like a minute. The second time, which I hope isn't happening right now, that's uh, not, I don't think. Okay, whatever. If it does, I don't get. Um, the first time, it, uh, was really really quiet for like two seconds where I was talking about something important not really it was just me saying Ruby let's play but it was really really quiet but um uh, what are some okay um one thing is uh I would like all my active subscribers to comment below because if I don't have enough active subscribers I'm going to make a new account on YouTube because I don't like unactive subs so yeah, if you're an active subscriber, I know Streaker is an active subscriber. I love you, bro. You're awesome, bro. Uh, I know Foxy is an active subscriber. You are awesome as well. Um, yeah, I don't know if you're a boy or girl. I'm just gonna assume you're a girl because you have Foxy, but you are awesome. Um, I know my friend Jurassio was an active subscriber before. Stuff I can't talk about happened. I think Wags might be an active subscriber, but he's a bitch sometimes. He's a fucking bitch. I'm gonna show you our conversation that we had right here. Alright. Can you believe that? What a faggot. I asked him to watch this video that I sent him, and he blew me off to go to school. Who goes to school anymore? Fucking bitch. Hello, Bojangles. How are you? I named my cat Bojangles. Cause that is an awesome name. Oh, you bitch. You're still awesome. Um, uh, some stuff I wanted to expand upon was I go on this chat in PokeProf, and it's basically um, it's basically a chat where you talk about Pokemon. But um, that's when I was in my quote-unquote prime. Not really prime. It was when I uh. <clears throat> first started out, I uh, searched up uh, Pokemon chats just because I thought I was the shit when I first started out. And they yell, I'll beat the shit out of anybody. And I go on this chat and then uh, I'm like, yo, yo boy, let me be a gym leader. And he's like, nah, nigga, you got to uh, battle this guy. And then I ended up battling, um, I forgot what his name was. Fuck. But yeah, I battled him and I lost terribly. Like, it was four Pokemon. I was like, yeah, it was like four Pokemon. He had like, yeah, he had four Pokemon left. All of them had full health. It was just, it was just a blowout. I got fucking raped. And then, um, he referred me to this guy named Lin. And Lin was like, fuck, it's not Rain. But, um, he doesn't go on the chat anymore. But, um, he referred me to this guy named Glenn. Oh, fucking shit. Whatever. Uh, I just lost my place, but I'm just gonna continue talking. Um, he referred me to this guy named Lynn. And, from there, Lynn was like, You wanna be a gym leader here? I was like, yeah, I'd be, yeah, I'd love to be a gym leader here. And he was like, alright, you can be a gym leader here. And, what I was at first was a sunny day team. So it's fire and grass. And, um, I was undefeated, but I told Mike Wags what my, uh, what my weakness was. And basically what my weakness was is pretty much uh, obvious. You bring a sandstorm Pokemon. And I lost to, to three people just that same exact way. It was annoying. So, um, I s and there was this guy named Joe, and Sir P Superior. And they kept on trying to take my badge, but they couldn't. But um, after I lost that third time, I got I was 
not gonna lie, I was kinda like, yeah, I fucking suck. I lost three times. So, um, I switched to a ghost gym. And then, from then, the, the chat split. And, based, like, before, b hold on, let me just talk about this before. Before they split, there was this guy named Lin, the guy that pretty much said, I'll make you a gym leader. This guy is fucking awesome. He, um, whenever I had a question, he would answer it. He's like some MLG battler guy. And he pretty much, like, makes me want to battle. And, uh, he's like my Master Roshi. I'm like, okay. I still don't know who would win. Probably him. Because he's a boss. But, um, yeah. And then the chat split. And all the people that went to the other side of the chat, not all, a lot of them, I really did not like. So I stayed on Pokeprof, and Lin was on Pokeprof. And then, like, not pe less people started coming to Pokeprof. And then, one day I, uh, went on the other chat, and then, uh, there was, like, everybody that was on Pokeprof was on there. And... Uh, Lin got mad, and I thought he quit, because he told me he was thinking about quitting, and he wasn't on for like a month, and then I was like, fuck it, so I stopped going on, and uh, after that I really lost my spirit to play Pokemon, so Lin, if you're watching this, you, you seriously are my inspiration, bro, and I still think you should make a YouTube channel, I'm not even joking, bro. I want to see how good of a battler you are. Um, I'll probably link you to this video. I'll probably put parentheses. Lin is a boss in in the in the title. He's honestly, this guy is awesome. He's like some type of wizard. Hey, he's a wizard. He has to be a wizard. <laughs> um, whenever there's like an argument or something in the chat, he uh resolves it. Like there was a argument the other day about gay homosexual stuff and honestly I'm not a homophobe or anything I'm not anything like that and uh, I went in the main chat just to see what they were talking about because I really don't go on the main chat a lot I just go in private chats and talk to people because I don't like it's not that I don't, random people come in the chat and they ask for battles and it's kind of annoying but if somebody asks for a gym battle I usually battle them and back when I used to when I was the ghost gym or that other gym whenever a random person would come on they'd be like hey you know I have all the badges on this other chat I like battle about gym leader and then uh I was the only one on I'd usually win I think I lost like to one random person but I mean I beat them and be a blowout because uh I I'm not trying to boost like blow my own horn or whatever the hell however that thing goes toot my own horn there you go uh, I'm not trying to do my own horn, but I was pretty good. And they weren't really good battlers, so I'd beat them, and then they'd be like, "Oh, I'm not coming. I'm not coming on here anymore." They'd be like, "Just because I beat you? Okay, let's see how it is." Um, I named this route Tranny, and the reason is because he's a boy, and uh, there's no Gallade in Ruby and Sapphire. Blah blah blah. I talked about this in my last commentary. It was annoying. That's why I named him Tranny. But um, yeah. So uh, there was like this argument going about homosexual people and whatnot, and then Lin was just like, "There's nothing wrong with homosexual people. They're born like that." And then there was a guy named Voltrax. He was like, "There, you can no, was it some somebody else? No, it was some other girl that that wasn't on when I was on there." Then she said, "You can you can turn gay." And then Lin was like, "You can't turn gay. You're born gay." And then they asked if he was gay. I was like, yeah. I was just thinking to myself, you shouldn't really ask somebody that. That's kind of messed up. And then another thing I thought was like, yeah, Lin sounds like an Asian name, and Asians can't be gay. It's against their, their, uh, uh, their like, I don't know. I forgot how. I, I don't know how. Oh man, I'm like stupid whenever I do commentaries. But um, my friend Kevin Lang. Is Asian and like their family look down upon gay people and yeah so this commentary is wrapping up uh, 
If you guys want to talk to me, go to PokePro. It's in that chat. You're not gonna get viruses, I promise. There's some pretty, really, really cool people. And if anyone just pisses you off, just message Lynn and be like, "This guy's just being a dick," or some. No, don't say being a dick because you're not supposed to curse on that chat. But yeah, bye. I forgot I was going to say that I was going to do a Pokemon rap in this video, so here it goes. I put it at the end so you guys don't have to listen to this if you don't want to. But here it goes. Hey guys, my name is Brendan. Last name O'Rourke. I eat pork. It is delicious. It is delicious because it rhymes with tiger. I'm a liar. It doesn't rhyme with tiger. But my favorite Pokemon is Primeape. The prime rib of rape. Who will rock you in the arena like Hurricane Katrina. But don't worry, this is just a fad soon to nose pass. What other Pokemon can I put to make this rhyme better? Um, let's see, I could put Gengar, because Gengar's a boss. Not like Lapras. Lapras is a fat ass bitch. Unlike Farfetch'd, he has a big dildo in his hands. That dildo is from Dusclops. He's a musty old fugly piece of shit. I don't know what to say. I'm done. Boss.